We work so you can play. Hey everybody, I'm going to walk you through how I painted up this guy, special character, Brother Corbello from the Blood Angels. Uh, it's an older model, but uh, new updated rules in the new codex. And uh, so yeah, just going to walk through, here's what it's going to look like when we're done. And uh, so, starting out with a white primer and everything, um, Mechorite Red with uh, Blood Angels Red Highlight um, and also uh, Bowel Red Wash. Uh, I'm just adding some uh, the Games Workshop sand to the base there. And now we're going to go on to the white bit. So this is um, Reaper Stormy Gray, actually sorry, Cloudy Gray, which is very similar to Codex Gray from Games Workshop. So any parts that are going to be white, I've just done those up in a gray color. Um, now for the gold bits, I'm going to do a bit of a non-metallic, and I'm using the same color for blonde hair. Uh, so this is uh, Reaper Palomino Gold. And here's a bit of the back. You can see parts here that are going to be gray and uh, gold on the shoulder pad there. Okay, now I'm adding some black bits. So this is just Reaper Pure Black. Uh, Chaos Black for Games Workshop works well too. As well, I've added some bolt gun metal uh, bits as well. So there's some bolt gun here, here, a bit on there. You see there's some gold bits, um, black tubing and hoses there. And in the back here's some bolt gun. Nothing too fancy. Okay, um, done a base coat on the base there. Starting to highlight up the, uh, the white as well as giving a bit of a black wash to any of the, uh, the bits there. Flesh has been given a base coat, Tolarian flesh, and denim stone for the scrolls. Oh, as well, um, used a Hormigon purple for the purity seals. And we go on to the back. Okay, so yeah, getting up the highlights now. So this is a cloudy, sorry, misty gray highlight here. So it's just a light gray, um, kind of like Astron Astronomicon gray from uh, Games Workshop. Um, just working things up a bit here. As well, I've uh, given a wash. So I think I've done all my washes and highlighting the red with uh, Games Workshop Blood Red. So as you can see with the, the, the light gray, it's uh, it looks white. These pictures is actually just a, a gray, but I'm basically painting everything except for the deep cracks. And so trying to uh, try to leave a little bit of a halo around everything. Here we go, uh, starting to highlight up some of the gold. So that was given a devil in mud wash, and then Palomino gold, and then uh, buckskin pale will be the top highlight. Uh, for the uh, bone bits there, that's just the Reaper bone triad. And I'm also using some uh, grays here to highlight up the black. see sort of how I'm doing the, uh, the gold there. And that's basically it. Um, there, a better picture. So the uh, the flesh there was done with the tan flesh triad from uh, Reaper. Um, up here was just the uh, Idean uh, Dark Sun Games Workshop. Um, like I said, the gold is uh, buckskin pale, the top highlight there. Uh, the gems, that's just uh, scab red, blood red, and uh, blaze orange with a little white dot, and then the the white for the edge highlight, I used a uh, the ghost white um, for the uh, for Reaper. So it's just it's just a slightly off white. There's actually no pure white on this guy. Bit of a different angle there. Um, the eyes are obviously you know they're tiny. I'm trying to get those in there. The the hair is the exact same color as the gold, so it's a blondish kind of a color. And the uh, the red on there, same sort of deal as the uh, all the gems. So base coat of uh, mechorite red, washed with the, the bell red, and then highlighted with blood red and uh, a bit of uh, blaze orange just on the edges. There's a good picture there of the, uh, the design on the shoulder with a sort of non-metallic. The idea just trying to highlight up to the really bright pot spots there and kind of blend it down, give it a bit of a metallic look using uh, non-metallic paints. And the base is just a little bit of static grass on top of the the sand sort of stuff that's been painted with uh, scorched brown and then a bit of bestial brown and then a bit of ash gray waste. 
that's about it. Hope you enjoyed it. Pretty quick uh, paint job on this guy. Um, nice and simple, and uh, gonna look good on the table. Thanks for checking it out.